Hey Lug Nuts, welcome to Lug Unplugged. It's me, Meredith here. Today I have a new unboxing for you. It's the new jumper carry-all. So let's see. So I bought it in black. The new prints, I wasn't a huge fan of them. Even I like the wildflower print, but Poppy Wildflower came off a little Christmassy to me with all the green and uh, it was really bright. And so I thought, you know, I don't, I'm not a huge bright colored person. So I thought I'm just going to go with the black because I think it will go with everything. It is smaller than I thought, actually. Um, it's definitely like a big handbag. I was like, my iPad will fit in here. Um, but I don't think it will hold like a eight and a half by 11 folder like the Windjammer will. But it's, I mean, it's cute. This is, these are shorter than I expected too. Um, I'm pretty tall. Yeah, that's not super comfortable for my arm. But on the crook of my elbow, that's totally fine. Um, so the, it's called the jumper, which is, can be confusing because there is the jumper backpack, um, which is also kind of a little bit of a smaller, like a school age backpack, but straps aren't super long on it. So this is the jumper. I guess it's just called the jumper on here. Um, they've been using, but it's got the puddle jumper pockets, which is why I think they wanted to stick close to that jumper name family. Um, these pockets are longer than like the ones on the puddle jumper. Not quite as long as like the north south one on the puddle jumper duffel. But still nice and long. In the promos, they put like a splits wallet in here. So a splits wallet or a handspring would totally fit in these front pockets. They have the flips so you can pop things in there. Love that when I'm like at the zoo, like I was this morning, I put my membership card in there and I can just pull that out really easy. Um, both of them have that. Then you've got your phone pocket here, which is always great. It does, it's fleece lined and it is tacked to the bottom so you can't invert it, which is nice. Sometimes when you pull your phone out and the pocket comes with it, that's not super helpful. Both sides have cargo pockets. Oh, and they have a magnet closure on them. That's nice. I like a good magnet closure on the pocket. <clears throat> there are D-rings that go with a crossbody strap, which I assume is inside. <clears throat> You've got four metal feet. Very nice and shiny, not plastic. These are nice and metal, which is good. They're sewn in. I mean, some people like to take the feet off. I don't know how you do that with this. These are really tightly sewn in. There's no um, seams to see that you can easily like pull off. It looks like there's a black ring around it. It's not, it's metal all the way. That's just reflecting the color. No wipeable bottom, just the regular fabrication, which I still love this like polyester fabrication more than the vegan leather. <clears throat> They've got a lot of bags in vegan leather and I still prefer the polyester. Um, backside, you've got a wide pocket. It goes all the way down, but it also goes up here so you can fit. Um, this is where you might be able to fit like an eight and a half by 11 notepad, notepad or folder. Um, the handles do have a non-slip no non grip. It's a rubbery here. All right, let's see what we got. Here's the strap, the crossbody strap. This is probably how I would carry it, even though I don't always like when the handles hang down. Um, because I just think that that's a more convenient way to carry this. <clears throat> the paperwork always comes with lug, including they put tissue paper to keep the, um, the clear view pocket from sticking. So you've got a really big clear view pocket here, a single that zips closed. Uh, nothing else on that wall. The bottom, by the way, has a cardboard piece or a, a more like sturdy bottom so you can pull that up to fold it flat or lay it down and it'll hold the base a little bit more. On the back wall, it says the lug jumper. You've got one cargo pocket, it's fleece lined, a pen holder, two pen holders, and a key bungee. Uh, and then that's all the internal organization. A big, I mean, it's got lots of space in there. So really nice, this would be a pretty good mom bag for when I don't have newborns, when I have um, older children that still maybe need snacks, this would be a great mom bag. I just came from the zoo, this would be excellent. I took my zip liner, but um, the zip liner gets kind of squishy with some snacks in it. This would have been a better bag. I'll take it next time I go to the zoo. 
Um, so the strap is a nice width. It's made of the same polyester fabric. Let's see if you can see the details there. And it does have the gunmetal hardware. So there you have it, the jumper in the, oh, the jumper, <laughs> sorry, in the black. There's this picture on mine of Amy Richter and she has poppy blue, a fabric swatch it looks like. I love that fabric swatch. So I just got excited thinking, is that a bag? No, I think it's just the fabric swatch. So making sure there's no secret hidden things on the, the little cards that tell us another color is coming. Nope, everything is out there. So there's the jumper for you. Let me know, did you get it? Do you like it? Is it coming to you? Um, how are you gonna use it? I might start using this right away. We're going on a vacation pretty soon. This will make a pretty nice uh, day tripping bag. So yeah, I might have to try it out. Uh, coming soon, I bought the Scoop 2. So that will be coming uh, in a couple days or in a week or two. Uh, and they have uh, the new summer surprise box. No hints whatsoever this time except the flamingos on it and I've got one of those coming my way. So I will do an unboxing for that. I'll try and keep spoilers out of my head, but I'm not very good at surprises. So no promises, I'll do my best. So thanks for watching. If you like my video, please click like and subscribe. See you later.